Welcome to this talk on good slide design. This talk is part of a series of videos on presenting well online. Good slide design is simple slide design. It uses graphics, simple designs, and as little text as possible. Let's look at some examples. Here are some results from a study of the effectiveness of visual learning software in the classroom. It's hard to figure out exactly what's going on here. There's a little too much data. It's clear that there's some kind of difference being shown, but exactly what it is is hard to tell. How much easier is this to see if we just make a simple graph? Now we've separated only one row out here, but it's very easy to see that there's a difference in the two study conditions. And we can also expand the graph then to talk about what happens when we retested the software six months later. Admittedly, there's less data on these two graphs, but this is where it's important to know what your main result is. What do you want to convey to the audience? Think about that clearly and it'll help you design your graphs. If you've got enough time, and if it's important to the audience, you can add additional graphs to cover the data in the other rows. Let's take a look at one more example. Say you've got a very complex set of data like these shown here, really almost impossible to show on a slide for anyone to see what you're doing. Simplify this. Pull out the study species and make a simpler phylogenetic tree that then can be used in other parts of your talk. For instance, to show character distributions. If you want to talk about this tree in different contexts, the audience will get used to seeing it and will understand it easily, even though they cannot read the text. Well, these are our two examples of using graphics and images to convey your meaning. The meaning has been simple and we've used as little text as possible. Thanks for listening. Please see the other videos to learn more.